There is a major manhunt happening in a Seminole County neighborhood right now. Deputies are trying to find a third suspect wanted in a botched home break in. Deputies say the homeowner opened fire on the burglars along Virginia Avenue in Altamont Springs. The suspects were then spotted by deputies more than 10 miles away along State Road 46 and International Parkway in Sanford. News 6's Troy Campbell is there live right now for us. So Troy, police are searching the woods and they're keeping you away, right? Well, in fact, Matt, a Sanford police officer inside of this gated community right here behind me told us that it is an active scene right now. For hours, we heard um, the sheriff's helicopter overhead. We saw patrol vehicles and they would use their headlights to shine them into the woods, all searching for that suspect. Searching into the night, Seminole County deputies and Sanford police trying to locate a third suspect in an Altamont Springs home invasion that occurred Friday afternoon. This surveillance video from a neighborhood near where the suspects dropped their vehicle shows the search from the ground. Well, normally we see bears in our surveillance camera, and this time we saw a police officer with the canine walking the fence property line. Penny Hopples says on a typical evening, the streets are filled with residents, but that's not the case Friday night. It was very unnerving, you know, and this subdivision, there's always people out walking with their dogs, and, and this time of night it would be people taking their evening stroll. There's nobody out right now. The Seminole County Sheriff's Office says the owner of this home on the 900 block of Virginia Avenue in Altamont Springs arrived to find two people inside during an apparent home invasion. A neighbor says he heard a gunshot after the homeowner opened fire. Then I saw the shot pop. Deputies spotting the suspect's vehicle moments later, with the car coming to a stop on State Road 46 and International Parkway, about 11 miles from the home. A man and a woman taken into custody. A third man, now the focus of a multi-agency manhunt. A neighbor near that home says they've had several home invasions within the last month. At this point, it's unclear how long law enforcement will search into the night. But in the meantime, people who live in this area say they're staying inside. Live in Sanford, Troy Campbell getting results. News 6. Troy, thank you.